Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here in Jaywick with a great man called Steve, and he has got a Triumph Bonneville, and it was made in the year 2000. And I thought it was made in the year. Shine on! We love you, Mr. Fuller. How are you, Gary? Shine on out, brother. We are, I am here with the mighty Steve, and Steve is a mighty man. And I said to Steve just now, oh, Triumph's not made in Britain anymore, it's made in India. But you, you corrected me, didn't you? Hinkley, Lincolnshire, Lincolnshire. And you brought this and you took it out of the package? Yeah, but I got this in America. You, you, well, tell me the story about this. Okay. I used to be a racer. Yep. And I had strong contacts with the original Triumph factory. Okay. When they re-established themselves yep. in 1995, yep. I got friendly with them and I used to be a test driver for their bikes. Superb. So they, every time a new model came out, they'd send me one and I could buy it at a real cheap price. Wow. But they said I was the only private person that would get a bike direct from England in the packing case. Yep. And then I had to put it all together and do a parade. And that's what you did with this in the year 2000? That's it. And then when I came back to England, I brought yeah. it with me. Ladies and gentlemen, Steve is going to give us a demonstration of what this year 2000 Triumph Bonneville sounds like. What size engine, Steve? It's 790. Put it in neutral. Key on. So it's still British. Okay. The Triumph is still British. Superb. See you later. See you later. The Triumph is still British. Shine on, cause so am I. And so are a few of my friends. We are still British. Whatever you say, Nigel Farage, shine on. I'm only joking. You've got a joke to enjoy life.